Ephesians chapter 2. Ephesians chapter 2. I'm going to read it to your hearing, verse 10. Ephesians 2 and 10. Ephesians 2, verse 10. Familiar passage of scripture. Follow along as I read. For we are his workmanship. Right, hmm. right. Created in Christ Jesus for good works, mm -hmm. which God prepared beforehand that we should walk in them. Amen. That the Lord bless his holy word. Amen. I'm going to Amen. talk to you from this subject, how God works in us. Mm. Turn to your neighbor. Good, neighbor. neighbor. Preacher's going to preach about it. Preacher's going to preach about it. How God works in us. How God works in us. That's it. Amen. Amen. You may be seen. That's it. That's where he works. New Year is upon us. We say, according to verses 2 and 8, by the grace of God, we have been saved through faith that are not of ourselves, that we give from God. Not something we should have done, so we shouldn't boast about it. Amen. Amen. Saying all of that, God works in us because we are saved. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. We are created in Christ into good works. Mm -hmm. We're not saved by good works, but saved unto good works. Mm -hmm. The text says we are His workmanship. Yeah. 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 The Greek word is. Poema, from which we get our word poem. The church is a poem in his creation. Right, right. Paul is not talking about the local church, but rather about a body of believers from the day of Pentecost to the rapture. Amen. Amen. That real believers, and most of them are members of local churches. That's what he's talking about. That body of believers is his workmanship and his new creation, their, his and their new creation, new creation is in Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. One famous theologian, John Calvin, familiar name, wrote that it is faith alone that justifies, but faith that justifies can never be alone. Mm -hmm. We are not saved by faith plus works, but by faith that works. That way. Amen. 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 Yeah. Basic scripture, if you read your Bible, the theme of James tells us where the writer points out that saving faith always results in a changed life. Amen. Amen. It works without faith. You say you have faith, but you ain't doing no work. Do you really have faith? Come on. <laughs> All right. It's not a son enough to say that we have faith. We must demonstrate the faith by our works. I'm going somewhere. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Oh, yeah. The Bible speaks of many different kinds of works. The Bible talks about a lot of kinds of works. There are the works of the law, which, which, which cannot say Galatians 2. Mm -hmm. There are the works of the flesh, which are listed in Galatians 5. Mm -hmm. Paul spoke of works of darkness, uh -huh. Romans 13. The dead works in Hebrews, mm. uh, 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 Hebrews 6 and 1, seem to be works that lead to death, since the wages of sin is death. Amen. Right. Yeah. Romans 6, 23. Mm -hmm. The works of righteousness, Paul talks about in Titus 3 and 5, not by works of righteousness, but we have done, but according to his mercy, he saved us by the washing and the regeneration of the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. The works of righteousness refer to religious works of other good deeds that sinners try to practice as a means of salvation. Hmm. And Isaiah declared that all our righteousness are as filthy yeah, rags yeah. in his sight. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Isaiah 64 and 6. <laughs> now if our righteousness are filthy, Reverend Hay, would we, 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 what must our sins be like? Wow. If our righteousness I'm so filled. What must our sin be like? The works Paul writes about uh, in Ephesians 2 and 10 have two special characteristics. I won't hold you long. First, they are good works. Turn to your neighbor and say, they're good works. In contrast to works of darkness and, if you will, wicked works. 
Now, if you contrast verse 10 in Ephesians 2 with Ephesians 2 and 2, you will see that the believer has Satan, that the unbeliever, the unbeliever, let me back up, the unbeliever has Satan working in him, and therefore his works are not good. All right. Verse 2 tells us, in which you once walked according to the course of the world, according to the prince of the power of the air, the spirit which now works in the sons of disobedience. One time and one time and one time we, we were working on the other side. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Amen. Mm -hmm. right. We were overtime. Working hard. Yeah. They're working hard at it. Right. <laughs> but watch this, but the believer has, has God working in him, and therefore his or her works are good. His or her works are not good because he or she himself is good. No, 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 not you're not good. But because he he uh, he has a new nature, Sister Jones, from God. Right, right. Yeah. And because the Holy Spirit works in us through him to produce these good works. Mm -hmm. Right. Let me make it plain. I didn't call myself to preach. I had no desire to do this. Amen. Amen. Wasn't on my mind. Amen. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. Far from it. Amen. We were talking in the hallway. How good God did it yesterday. Yes, sir. And we got the water stopped and mopped up. Brother mm -hmm. Kenny and Brother Moe. Mm -hmm. Things we've done in young folk. Thank you. Amen. We ain't robbed nobody. Uh -huh. We ain't shot nobody. We haven't stabbed anybody, but uh -huh. we ain't always been working on the, on the Lord. Y'all so right. right. yeah. can say amen. 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 We talking about doing real good work. Amen. But God has been good to us. Yeah, yeah. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Mm. Beloved, it, 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 it is too bad. It is too bad that many believers minimize the place of good works in the Christian life. Mm -hmm. yeah. we, we we minimize it. Mm -hmm. The Bible tells us in Matthew five sixteen. It tells us, y'all heard it. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works in the there, uh -huh. and glorify your God, your Father which is in heaven. In heaven. Paul said, I was made a preacher. I, I was made a preacher. God, God, God touched me. The Holy Spirit grabbed a hold of me. Mm -hmm. And he grabs a hold of us. Mm -hmm. But by grace have you been saved by faith. It's a gift from God. God yeah. gave it to you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Paul desired that, that, that Christ would be magnified in his body, even if it meant death. Right. Philippians 1. And we should abound to every good work and be faithful and, and, and be fruitful in good works. Now, one result of the knowledge of the Bible is that the believer is thoroughly equipped for every good work. Yeah. That's why you need to be equipped. You need, you need to study to show thyself approved. Work and need not be ashamed, rightly divide the truth. You know, you need to read your Bible. You need training. You know, I always train. I'm always under older pastor. I'm always, that's why I go to the Congress, the National Baptist Convention. You cannot quit learning. You, got, you have to grow in ministry because there is no school on how to pastor. Ain't none. I know that's a bondage, young folk. Ain't none. You've got to rely on Jesus. You've got to rely on the right. Lord. You've got to rely on the Holy Spirit. There's right. preaching schools. There's exegetical schools. There's homiletical schools. There's systematic theology schools. There's, there's classes for all those. But there is none on pastoring and how to lead a church. Mm -hmm. That books folks right, but there's no, there, there, there's no blueprint on it. Right. Mm -hmm. Like how to usher. Uh, how the deacon. You have to rely on the Holy Spirit. And we should abound every good work and be fruitful in every good work. Now, as believers, we are to be zealous of good works. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amen. As believers, our good works are actually spiritual sacrifices that we offer to God. Amen. All right. yeah. It is important. It is so important, Sister Hegwood, to know that we do not manufacture these good works. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We do not nope. manufacture these good works. Here it is. I learned this a long time ago. We, at our best, are still a bad representation of God. When we get up in the morning, that's why we ought to say, Lord, forgive me. And here I am again. I'm just this earthen vessel. <laughs> this clay, I'm marred and I'm I messed up from the floor. Just use me how you want to use me today. 
They are the results of the work of God in our hearts. Now, for those that are taking notes, this is something that you can write down and you can, you can stick to you today. Listen, God never measures the mind. He always puts his tape measure around the heart. All right. <laughs> All right. Amen. He don't measure it at the heart. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Always. David was a man after God's own heart, but he messed up. Right, right. Did a little something, something here, did a little right. something, something yeah. there. Right. Man after God's own heart. Yeah. But he couldn't leave the rooftop alone. Right. There you go. Amen. Amen. Yeah. All right. Amen. Preach for me. They in Sunday school talking about trying to, you know, y'all know he's trying to be, I know he's trying to be hilarious, but you know, we blaming, no, the man messed up. We try to blame, it was, it was in it. Yeah, it was. Uh -huh. It was in that. Yes, it was. Uh -huh. For Adam all have seen. Right. Uh -huh. But in Jesus, all have been made alive. Right. That's what the Bible said. Adam was a man of the flesh. Yes, right. right. he was. Amen. He saw the tree. Yep. Lord. Amen. He saw the apple. Uh -huh. He had to do his thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then he wanted to blame. Y'all know the story. He, yeah. had, he not only blamed the woman, yeah. but he blamed God. Yeah. Yeah. Fellas, y'all can say amen. Yeah. Yeah. And we're doing that right today. Amen. Yeah. David ain't got nobody to blame but himself. But the thing, the thing is, y'all, can I preach it like a fella? Bathsheba just looked too good. Amen. <laughs> amen. Right. Amen. Amen. Brandy said, all up on the roof. Oh, and if you ain't careful, you'll continue to hang out on that roof. Yep. But thanks for the God, the Holy Ghost. Yeah. yeah. He'll it. bring you down the steps. That's it, yeah. Yeah. But he was a man at the God's own heart. Mm -hmm. Yes, he was. Paul told the church at Philip, got tired. It is God which worketh in you both to will and to do for his good pleasure. Mm -hmm. yeah. The secret of Paul's good works was the grace of God. That's that, yeah. that's, that's the sermon right yeah. there. That's what we talking about. It, 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 it's all about the grace of God. That's it. It's all about the grace of God. I'm here. That's it. It's all about the grace of God. God Shoemaker's here. That's it's it. all about the grace of God. Bell is here. It. it ain't because we've been all that. It's by the grace, the grace of God. Of God. Yeah. Right. Am I right about it? Right. It's just by the grace of God. Am I right, Rem Paul? Right. It's by the grace of God. Uh -huh. So who should we boast about? Right. Yeah. Listen, our good works are evident that we have been born again. Thanks be to Jesus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Use what you have. Start where you are, but do what you can. Right. You got to start where you are. Right. Read a piece about that last week. Tremendous message. Yeah. Don't, go, yeah. go, 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 don't look back. Yeah. Hey, man, you, uh -huh. you, you, don't, don't, don't go back. That, that, that stuff is gone. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Jesus said, not everyone that says to me, Lord, 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 Lord. Lord. Yes, uh, didn't he say that? Yes, he Let me finish it up. But he that does the will of my Father, which is in him. Yes. Matthew 7, 21. Everybody that say to me, Lord, Lord, they, you, they, they, that's not going to get you to heaven. Into the kingdom. Our good works are testimonies, also testimonies to the lost. They win us right when they are heard. Amen. Brothers and sisters, if, if God sends us mm -hmm. on stony paths, he will also provide some shoes. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. That's it. Uh -huh. Amen. Mm -hmm. If he sends you on a stony path, he's going to provide you some shoes. Right. Uh -huh. Amen. Yeah. We are God's workmanship. Yes, sir. Created in Christ Jesus for good works. Mm -hmm. Let me crease the sleeve, then we can go on home. The believer, the believer experiences two creations. Nicodemus went through that right. when he came to Jesus at night, John chapter mm -hmm. 3. Both a natural birth and a spiritual birth. Mm -hmm. The spiritual birth is the point of this verse right here. When a man believes in Jesus Christ, God creates in him Christ. Mm -hmm. Christ in you, you in Christ. Now what does that mean? I'm glad you asked. What does that mean? 
God creates in him Christ. What does that mean? It means that God quickens the spirit and makes his spirit alive. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yeah, yeah. Amen. Whereas the believer's spirit was dead to God, right. sin was the spirit in which we lived at one time, mm -hmm. and the power that held us sway over our lives. Mm -hmm. And what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do, Counts? We, we follow the standards of the world, and we rebelled against God. Mm. And if you read verses 1 through 7 in Ephesians 2, that's where we were at one time. Amen. We were rebellious to God. Amen. Not that you were crook or you were criminal, but you were, we had a rebellious state. Uh -huh. And what happened? God quickens the spirit, meaning also, watch this, that God causes the believer to be born again yes. spiritually. Thank God for the born again. Mm -hmm. That God actually places his divine nature, here we go, into the heart of the believer. Mm -hmm. This is a heart thing, you all. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that God actually creates a new man out of the believer. That's where we are. Right, right. That God renews the believer by the Holy Spirit. You can't, you can't make it without the Holy Ghost. All right. All right. All right. And folks scared nope. of the Holy Ghost, don't be scared yeah. of the Holy Ghost. That's it. Amen. 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 That's it, man. Amen. That's the why don't be scared even to say the Holy Ghost. Yeah. Right. That's right. Don't be scared oh, of the Holy right. Ghost. Right. People in church, well, they got the Holy Ghost. You ought to run toward them. Right. Right. Instead of running away from them. That's it. Right. 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 They got too much tea. They got That's too right. much Holy Ghost. They clapping and shouting, yeah. raising their hands, amen, uh -huh. and talking in another life. That's yeah. where you need to be. That's it. Uh -huh. That's it. <laughs> yeah. One time you were in them clubs. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. Drinking that yak. Thank you. Hanging out with Jack. Yeah. Uh -huh. Hanging out with Jim. Yeah. Uh -huh. Hanging out with Canadian. Right. Hanging out with Cutty Sark. Y'all right. yeah, know when I hang with Mr. Trader Ray. Right. And you was having a good time. Right. Doing the bump in the funky four corners. Excuse yeah. me, young folks. <laughs> that one slipped. Yeah. Yeah. It was a four corners, but it got a little bit wet. Because the Holy Ghost is alive and because the Holy Ghost is around, right. we're afraid of the Holy Ghost. Right. Let your favorite song pop up. You couldn't find a partner quick enough. Right. And, and wait a minute. If you, if you couldn't find a partner, some of y'all would get on the dance floor and say, well, and dance by yourself. Right. <laughs> right. Get it, Reverend. Get it, Reverend. Because yeah. 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 they was playing my song. Then ask your mama. She know I'm talking right. <laughs> but what happened? God fashions man and woman and creates what? A masterpiece. A work of art. Turn to your neighbor and say, neighbor, you're a work of art. You're a work of art. Look at you. Carly, you're a work of art, man. Amen. We are God's workmanship, a work of art, a masterpiece, yeah. a new creation. And you know what? As Reverend said in Matthew 28, God wants to have us on display. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. They go out in Walmart, right. wherever you go, right. Kmart, right. Macy's, amen. Right. Wherever you shop at, Penny's, yeah. amen. Tight yeah. shopper. We are always on display because we are God's workmanship. Right. Created in Christ Jesus to do good works. Folks ought to see some Holy Ghost in you. They ought to see some Jesus in you. They ought to see how your foul things come out of your mouth. Right. They ought to see you trying to do the right thing. Right. Right. Amen. Right. Amen. Because salvation is something only God can do, yeah. and in his powerful creative work in us. People are recreated into new people. Amen. And those new people form a new creation. And here's what we form, Brother Bell. We form the church. Amen. 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 That's what we are. Amen. We form the church. Yeah. Listen, this verb, I'm almost done. This word created is used, is used only of God. For mm -hmm. only God can truly create. Mm -hmm. As he created the universe from nothing, so he creates new, alive, spiritual things from the old. Mm -hmm. The dead, the sinful creatures, you all, mm -hmm. we were. So we tell us, the Bible tells us, in 2 Corinthians 5, 17, so if anyone is in Christ, they are a new creation. I love that text. 
everything old has passed away. And you see, behold, everything else has become new. You ought to thank God you ain't like you used to be. They say that song, I ain't what I was, but I, 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 ain't, what I, 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 ain't, I ain't there yet, but I'm better than what I was. That's right. Christ has provided salvation. Not only does he change us radically into new creatures, he also wants us as a display cases for his artistry. He wants us to be a display for his artistry. According to this verse, we as believers are his workmanship. We are his masterpiece. And as we talked about the Reverend Towns of Sorrow looks back, worry looks around, but faith looks up. Some of y'all missed it. Let me say that again. Sorrow looks back, worry looks around, but faith looks up. I'm done here. May the Lord bless you real good. Many churches are in need of what every football team has. Football teams have what you call cheerleaders. Yeah, 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 yeah. And the job of the cheerleader is to tell everybody that we're going to make it. Oh, y'all with me, man. And I think Alice is a cheerleader at some of the academy. She, she's a cheerleader. And the job of the cheerleader is to tell everybody that we're going to make it. No matter, no matter how bad things look, no matter what's on the scoreboard, that there's still hope. You can be 30 points down at halftime, and the star player could be hurt, but you're still on the phone, me? On the sideline, cheering to say there's still hope. Cheerleaders system out you all the way to the end of the game. And they, and, and they act like the team is winning yeah. by a big score, Dad. Yeah. Even though there may be victory, it is almost impossible. Yeah. Their job is to be a cheerleader. Yeah. Cheerleaders are always on display. Yeah. Cheerleaders are always uniform. Oh, yeah, yeah. Cheerleaders are always excited. Oh, yeah, yeah. Cheerleaders are always jubilant. Yeah. Leaders are always energized. You know, when folks come into Jay's churches, broken, yes, sir. wounded, y'all want to hear me? Fractured, busted, disgusted, they need to run it to some cheerleaders. That's it, man. They need to run it. I don't care what it looks like at church. That's right. That there is That's still it. hope. That's they it. need to hear somebody say, I don't care what it looks like. Yes, sir. You Go can ahead, make it. You can make it. You can make it. Yes. I don't care. Y'all want to hear me? What you've been through, you can make it. I don't care how much money you owe yeah. yeah. you can, can make it. it. I don't care what the doctors say, yeah. you can, you can it. make it. Folks ought to come in here thinking that they are a nobody. Looking for anybody they can tell them about somebody and then and tell them that there is somebody who can save everybody. Folks ought to come in here and see some cheerleaders. But we just sitting around. I ain't done nothing. Last year in 2017, the folks will see us and say, Why should I be doing this church? Them folks don't know the Lord. Jesus ain't done none of them. And we sitting here like this here.
Lord it tells somebody to seek the Lord. This is why he may be found. And turn upon him for him. That's what he did. We ought to be cheerleaders for Christ. Amen. We ought to be cheerleaders for Christ.